What's going on everyone and welcome back to the channel. Today, I've got another AFL video and topic to talk about. This time, actually, I'm going to be talking about the next Rioli that will be coming into the AFL. And for those of you who haven't heard of this, there is going to be Rioli coming to the AFL very shortly in the 2020 AFL draft. Now, if you guys are getting very excited that, hold on, our team could potentially draft him here. Unfortunately, there aren't really any teams that can draft him besides Richmond and, I believe, Fremantle. The reason is so is because the Rioli that is upcoming is Morris Rioli Jr., who is the son of a, one of the AFL's legends in Morris Rioli, who I believe was the first Rioli to actually play AFL. He played 168 games for South Fremantle before Trent, you know, going into the uh, VFL where he played for Richmond from 1982 to 1987, playing 118 games where he kicked 80 goals. He also, yeah, won the Waffle Premiership in 1980, two-time Richmond Best and Ferris, 82 to 83. Won the Norm Smith in 82, um, even though I believe Richmond actually did lose that grand final. And yeah, he was in the VFO Team of the Year for, uh, for in 1983. His son is actually going to be getting drafted. Now, I do believe he has the option between Fremantle or Richmond. But from what we know, it's pretty much been made clear like from the very start that he wants to come to Richmond. I believe he's actually trained at Richmond multiple times. He's currently living in Victoria right now, I do believe. And he um, has been, you know, he's, he hangs out with Daniel Rioli quite a bit and all of that type of stuff so yeah it's pretty much set in stone now that he will be coming to richmond as a father-son prospect now an article was recently released on the afl because rioli actually kicked uh four goals and yeah it says richmond father-son prospect morris rioli jr 18 years of age developed a sharp reminder as his credentials for this year's afl draft so yeah it's actually it is pretty impressive i'm really excited to see some more highlights actually, you know, eventually come out of Morris Rioli Jr. And yeah, it's going to be extremely interesting to see. They pretty much recap some of the uh, awards and stuff his dad won. And yeah, it says Essendon has also had ties uh, to the Tiwi Islands as part of their Next uh, Generation Academy zone. But Rioli and fellow cousin in um, 2015 Norm Smith's medalist Ciro Rioli's footsteps, the young star has also had a close bond with cousin and Richmond Premiership player Daniel Rioli. The pair having spent also a lot of, a lot of time together at the Tigers. Morris Rioli Jr. is a nephew of former SNM player Dean and is related to West Coast Premiership forward Willie Rioli and St. Kilda defender Ben Long. He is expected to play for Northern Territory in this year's um, national uh, under 18 national champions. So yeah, we'll get a lot of you know, very high ex uh, highlights or, or sorry, of him when the uh, competition sorry, does actually um, end up coming around. So I'm extremely excited to see what Morris Rioli Jr. Um, does. For those of you who don't know, I'm actually a massive Richmond fan. So because I pretty much know that this is, uh, you know, we have the most likely chance of, you know, getting him and he's pretty much already committed to the club. I am very excited to see what can potentially happen with, you know, Morris Rioli Jr. And the fact that Richmond might even go into the 2021 season with two Riolis on their list in Daniel Rioli and Morris Rioli Jr. is a pretty cool thing to potentially see. But yeah, I do believe Fremantle do have, yeah, it says uh, Rioli is eligible to play join Richmond or Fremantle or SNMV the draft, but has previously indicated his desire to play in the yellow and black. Because I believe, you know, his father played for East Fremantle and he is uh, from Tiwi Islands, which Essendon have, you know, a kind of zone academy with. Then, yeah, I think it's going to be pretty interesting. But they also say he played for South Fremantle, which means he does qualify for Fremantle as father-son selection. But, yeah, as I was saying earlier, he's, he has indicated his desire to play in the yellow and black. But anyway, to thank you guys so much for watching this video. Make sure to leave a like and subscribe to the channel for all the latest AFL content and AFL news and all that type of stuff. Don't forget to comment in the comment section down below. What are your thoughts and opinions on another Rioli coming into the AFL? Are you guys excited? Who do you guys think are going to draft him? Do you guys think it's a lock that Richmond are going to draft him? Do you guys think it's a lock that he wants to go to Richmond? 
all that type of stuff. I definitely would really like to know your thoughts and opinions down below. And also tell me, did you guys know there was a new Rioli coming into the AFL? Again, I definitely would really like to know your thoughts and opinions on it all down below. Also, don't forget to subscribe to my gaming channel and my IRL slash long channel. Links for them are in the description down below. And go check out my podcast as well if you guys haven't already, where I talk about AFL and NBA content, just sports content in general. Definitely check that out. Links for that are in the description down below. So I was saying thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure to leave a like, subscribe, and comment. And I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye.